All right. So this is going to wrap up my review of the movies I've recently watched. And this one's a Canadian movie. So I'm Canadian. So uh, it's kind of fun. It's uh, by Adam McGoyan. Adoration. So I never, I never watched uh, this movie. I, um, I don't even remember it, you know, coming out. I mean, he, he's, there's not 2000, I think it's a 2009, is it? It's 2009, I think. Um, so yeah, Adam McGoyan uh, is one of the, one of the bigger, or yeah, I mean, one of the bigger English um, Canadian filmmakers. And so, uh, you know, his movies would get some, some play at the kind of art house theaters and stuff around town, but like more in Canada, it's more, um, or especially I'm in Montreal, so it's more French Canadian, uh, movies, which are, you know, pretty big. The French Canadian, um, movie industry is hopping because they've got an audience, right? They've got six, six, six or eight million, whatever it is, the French Canadian people. And they, they really, they watch those movies. So every, you know, they're always turning out big, big budget movies I mean, for, uh, for Canada. Um, whereas, uh, you know, the English Canadian market is a lot smaller because even though there's more people, most people watch Hollywood movies, which are also in English and, you know, and kind of more bigger. But anyway, so this one is a um, Canadian. So they kind of end up being art house movies, Canadian English ones. And so Adam Goyen is an art house movie director. He did his famous one was um, about the kids on the school bus in BC who who uh, who died. Uh, I can't remember. Sweet hair after. Sweet hair after. Um, so I saw that one. But this one, this one was uh, interesting. Uh, it was it follows a kid um, who's on the box. Is right there. I'm not sure the actor's name, but um, he. I bet you it's Noah Jenkins, Noam Jenkins. Um, but he's anyway. This he those this boy um, does this. Uh, his. Um, um, mom and dad die in a car crash and he's looking into understanding his parents um, and he ends up writing something about his dad being um, in, a, in the class at school that he his uh, like a fictional piece about his dad as if his dad was um, somewhat like a historical terrorist, I suppose, who, who sent a bomb with his pregnant wife to Israel. So not the same, not actually his dad, but he writes it from the perspective as if that's his dad anyway. And then it kind of goes into end up being kind of like a family drama, figuring out you know, but a, but a blown up family drama because his, um, his, uh, um, he's raised by his uncle and then his teacher, you know, is interested in him. And it turns out he, his teacher's kind of, uh, she's a sort of a mother figure, but in this weird kind of uncle, uh, teacher who's some, who ends up being somewhat related to, um, his family, uh, but um, yeah, so it's like a, a neat kind of coming of age, but also like family drama exploration movie. Um, yeah, and I I actually 
you know, liked it. I avoided watching it for a long time because, you know, the the art house movies can be harder to stick in the in the DVD sh- shoot. But uh, but I ended up I ended up quite liking it, um, you know, and uh, and the the acting is, you know, is pretty good and and um, yeah, it's kind of offbeat, but it ends up by the end it ends up working pretty well and and you come to a, um, a pretty good place. So I I, I quite enjoyed it. So just uh, Stephen Holding, the New York Times here said. A, provo- a profound and provocative exploration of cultural inheritance, an enthralling story. Well, which is true, yeah, there, there is some, you know, kind of cultural, also, but family inheritance as well, you know, but there's, there is some cultural stuff, but, you know, family is culture. Well, Yes, there's no no other quotes here that we can look at, but um, yeah. Anyway, oh look at that, it won something at Cannes, Festival de Cannes, winner. I don't know what prize that is, but um, yeah. So it was uh, it was it was a goodie, another goodie by Adam Agoyan, who. Uh, you know, uh, I'm sure he works real hard to make his films. I mean, geez, English Canadian, um, you know, uh, filmmaker. Um, so yeah, it, uh, it definitely. You know, I might even keep this one. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about that, but um, it's pretty. It was pretty darn good movie, and and uh, you know, it's just the rewatchability. Do I do? Is it good enough that I want to actually rewatch it? be helpful if I had a girlfriend, I guess, for that kind of thing, because then I could, um, you know, uh, woo her with my, um, my art house movies. But, um, oh, well, oh, well, that's another, that's, that's another video. Um, but, uh, yeah, anyway, so that's, uh, that's the end of my, my videos. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna show you also what this, I'm gonna watch this one tonight, but anyway, this will be another video. September Dawn. I don't know anything about it, but uh, there we go. I'm gonna watch that one. It looks like a western, an old duster. <laughs> My dad loved the dusters. All right, so um, so that's it. So Adam Agoyan, yeah, give it a go. If you're, especially if you're not Canadian and you're like never heard of them, look it up. Look it up, and and uh, maybe you'll like it. All right, take care. Hope you have a good night.